Hi there, this video will describe how to add exponential height fog to a level in the Unreal Engine. Our previous video I've set up an environment and then changed the daylight scene uh, lighting to a night scene. Um, so now we can talk about adding uh, some effects in here and one of those effects is the uh, ability to see fog. There is a atmospheric fog which is fog that's uh, really far away on the horizon line and into the sky sphere. But if we want to add fog that's closer to the camera and closer to the player, we can add the exponential height fog. So let's go ahead and drag one in. So this is underneath the place actors visual effects. And I'm going to click and drag from uh, the exponential height fog. You can see the moment I do this, it goes ahead and adds uh, fog throughout my entire scene, but a good distance away from the camera. So I'm going to drag this up, kind of move it up above everything. It is going to look very similar uh, to the uh, atmospheric fog icon, but this is the exponential height fog. So basically the further away it is from the camera the more fog can appear and we can change the uh, settings for that. Alright, so <clears throat> exponential height fog uh, has specific details over here, so we're going to change the fog density, uh, which I'll look up at the horizon, you can change that. See how far up vertically it's going to uh, add that fog, so maybe we want to keep it low, something like that. Uh, we have a fog height fall off, which is how far or how fast of a fall off it has. We'll change that just a little bit. Um, so we also have color and opacity. Um, so under fog in, in scattering uh, color, so I can change that to be a much darker fog if I wanted to, uh, or a specific color. Right. So let's actually just add a darker fog to this, okay. and I can change the opacity of that if I want to as well. But I'm just going to leave that at one for right now. So I can have more of a com or, uh, more of a cool, warmer color fog if I wanted to. So the other thing to adjust, there's a bunch of settings here, but there's another section I want to talk about, which is this volumetric fog section. And if I turn on volumetric fog, and uh, you can see it slightly changed things, but what's really going to matter is if I come in here and play with the uh, extension scale. So you see with that extension scale, uh, the fog gets closer to the camera. So 0 to 10, but I can also say 50. So that means there's more fog closer to the camera than if I put that down to like 5. Okay. Um, there's also the albedo and emission. So if I drag this down, that will kind of make it much darker of a fog. And I can change the emissive if I want to. So drag it about you up. Make it lighter. If I want a lighter fog, but I want a darker fog, so let's keep that. And let's pull up our extension scale. So let's do something like 50. There we go. So the fog is much closer to the camera now. If I move further away from something, the objects will be further into the uh, fog. Okay, there we go. So I can come back and keep playing with this further. Uh, I can drag that fog down so it is. You know, fill in the whole scene more, if you can see that, fog density. Okay, so then I can go back down to my extension scale and drag that up further, 100. So now my fog is pretty uh, filling out the scene. I have to get really close to an object to be able to see it or not. And then keep playing around with this. So uh, volumetric fog is really neat. Uh, it's part of this exponential height fog. I can also uh, add volumetric lighting and fog to specific lights. So if I come in here with a, uh, let's do a point light. So just drag a point light in here. And I'm going to change the type of light so it's movable. So I don't have to build lighting. Okay, so with this light, you can see if I go play, or the light is, it's actually producing. Uh, volumetric fog on and from that light as well, which is kind of neat. So that's another way to kind of add a different atmosphere to a game, um, to add some volumetric lighting. Okay. And we can keep playing around with some of these things to kind of make our full adjustments to the way the lighting is producing uh, the shadows. Uh, within the environment, so quick video that's how we can set up volumetric fog and play around with lighting in the scene. 
uh, to really change the mood and atmosphere of our environment. So we can have thicker fog, we can have lighter fog, uh, but it definitely changes the uh, mood of the environment uh, with some atmospheric height fog in here. All right, that'll wrap up this video on uh, adding a atmospheric height fog volume to the uh, to the Unreal level.